The new owner of the Butte Plaza Mall will be spending the next year and a half redesigning this building and bringing in new tenants. And once it's done, he says it's going to look completely different. I mean, I realize the mall's pretty dead inside, and you know, our goal is to revitalize it and kind of turn it inside out. Dickerhoof Properties purchased the mall from the Hyman Family Trust in May for $8.5 million. The new owner's redesign, which will begin next year, will drastically change the way the current facility looks. The, the terminology developers use is called demalling, where you, you flip it out inside out and you have more bigger stores with their own facades. There's about six businesses interested in locating in the new plaza. We are working with some clothing, tenants, shoes, uh, beauty and makeup. The developer is expecting the former Herbergers portion of the mall will likely be torn down to make room for a yet unnamed grocery store. Dickerhoof believes you know, Butte residents will be happy with the new store. This grocer, I think, will be very competitive on pricing, which will make some of the other grocers have to compete with them. And I think that'll be good for the, the citizens. The mall's manager believes the purchase of the mall is more than just business. Total divine intervention. I believe it. I believe it. I believe he's an answer to a prayer. The mall has been steadily losing tenants over the years, and Furco was having a really bad day when she pulled out her Rolodex and Dicker Hoof's business card fell out. And I called my mall owners and said, you guys need to call him. If you don't call him, I'm going to call him. And I was having such a bad day that they knew that I meant business. I, I never had that tone with them before. Dickerhoof said construction will begin next year and some tenants could be in by 2026. This is, this is a rebirth. This is good for not just the mall, this is good for our community. This is good for Southwest Montana. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.